Before the bionic leg, I, I had uh, strength in the leg, but I didn't have any control in it. And when I put the bionic leg on, it kind of uh, gave me the restraint when I, when I sat down. And it helped me as I lifted myself, and it really helped me going up and down the steps. So I applied for a social security disability, and I was approved the first time. They realized that I really got hit hard. However, I wasn't satisfied with that. My wife is sick, she has lupus. I need medical benefits, I'm only 58 years old. So I put in my mind that I'm gonna go back to work and do something because I need the medical benefit. I said to them, we have jobs there that I can do and you have to, by law, give me a chance at it. And they said, well, no, we don't. Well, they fought me for almost a couple months. One day before my medical benefits ran out, one day before, they hired me back. If it wasn't for the Tyrion Bionic Leg, I probably, I wouldn't be able to hold this job that I have right now. When you hear that noise, you know that you're not giving 100%. Even though a therapist can say to you, lean to the left, your bad side, and put more weight on that. You're not, you're not doing it. You can try to do it, and you, they really can't tell. And you can't really tell. However, when you have the bionic leg on and it starts screaming at you, it, it makes you, uh, you know, more aware that the, you're not really doing what you're supposed to be doing. And not only you know it, everybody in the room knows it. I almost thought about actually retiring, and I thought, no, I'm not gonna retire. I'm 58 years old, I'm gonna work till 65. I'm working, that's it. So.